Here's a Bible quote that I want you to believe about yourself. When you hear the Bible, I want you to take it on. I want you to wear it. I don't want it to be about somebody else. I want it to be about you. In Psalms 145 verse 16, it says the truth about you. Thou openest thy hand. What, what does it mean to open your hand? Well, it doesn't mean to clench it tight. It means to be open, be ready to receive. It doesn't mean to repel. It means to be open, ready to receive. Now, I continue. Thou satisfies the desire of every living thing. You can receive from God. You open up your hand, which is a metaphor for opening up your mind, opening up your heart, opening up your soul to the good of God, and allow God to bless you richly. And you accept the good from God so that you can live life abundantly. See, God has endowed you with everything that you need to live a rich and abundant life and a life that is filled with peace, a life that's filled with love, a life that's filled with joy, a life that's filled with health, and a life that is happy every single day. God is ever-present within you as strength, as courage, as wisdom, as knowledge that you get through your human mind and a human mind that's open instead of closed so that you can receive good and more good all the time. God's gifts to you are many beyond anything that you can imagine at this point. You are given freedom of choice. You're given the ability to think and God is ever filling your mind with a wealth of, of divine ideas. As you accept and use these ideas from God, you are enriched. As you recognize God's perfect, ever-renewing, exhilarating life, you express perfect health, you align your will with God's will, and you're assured of the perfect outworking in every situation, problem, difficulty that you're facing. God is ever filling your heart with perfect love. Love for you to express. Love for you to accept. And as you enjoy peace and harmony, as you live in happiness... You hold to your faith in God as the one presence and the one power in your life. And you recognize your oneness with God's absolute goodness. And you're blessed continually.